Hello everyone and welcome to another Historic video. So today we're going to be taking a look at Shadow's deck in No Bandless Historic. Like I mentioned in the last video, there is currently an event going on that will last for two weeks. It's all access, you don't have to craft any cards, just import the deck and you can play it with any cards that are available in Historic. So that means in the Shadows, now we get to play with Ragavan. Now we get to play with Unnerfed Dragon Rage Chandler. And we get to also play with Mishra's Bobble to flip the Dragon Rage Chandler with ease. So we are a Shadow deck, so we're going to be playing a lot of Pain Lands. We're going to be playing a lot of Shock Lands. And instead of Memory Lapse, we're playing two copies of Counter Spell and two copies of Spell Pierce and a copy of Drown and Lock in this deck because you want to fully counter things in this format. Because let's say if opponent channels on turn two, then you need to have a Counter Spell to fully counter that because otherwise next turn if you memory lapse it they're just going to play it again and then just combo you to death on the spot so memory lapse not so great when they can just replay it next turn when the card itself just wins you the game so we want to fully counter things we want to discard things with thought seizes and stuff so so i'm excited first time playing with ragvan and counter spell so having said that we're going to be jumping into some games in the historic no ban list queue to show you guys how the deck does so let's hop on over Okay. Um, sure. Maybe we just... Brainstorm turn one. How's that for end of the turn? Um... I guess this doesn't really matter. Just take a look at what they got. Ooh, okay. Ragavan and the Thought Seas. Um, just take out Fire's Prophecy, play Ragavan. So we just need to get rid of, uh, draw a blue source for turn four. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay, that kind of sucks. Yeah, that kind of sucks. <laughs> we'll shock that in. Now we can go Caller Spell or Orcish Bowmaster. Just gonna attack here. Then we're going to Orcish Bowmaster their Shark Typhoon. I probably should have put, played a land. But I'm sure it won't really matter too much. I guess uh, we'll leave up uh, Orcish Bowmaster and Counterspell. I mean, this is... Ragavan is a fair card. Ragavan is a fair card. Okay. I am loving this format, by the way. 
Ragavan Thoughtseize. Ragavan Thoughtseize. Let's go. Thought sees you. You're playing elves? There's so many things you can do and you're playing elves. That's crazy. Just like that. Ragavan, Thought sees, win the game. It's that easy. <laughs> it's that easy. Oh my god. This is the dream combo, isn't it? Brainstorm? I'll keep a brainstorm. The one ring. Well, I do kind of want that as well. Wow. Goodbye channel. <laughs> and we also know they're not drawing channel next turn. Do I even want that brainstorm anyways? Maybe we don't. That'll put an instant speed in the graveyard. Ah, that's kinda... It's kinda whatever, actually. Land in the graveyard. That worked out. Now we have a Thought Seize and a Spell Pierce. That's really nice. Okay. Man, having counter spells and discard spells are so good against, like, the current decks at the moment. Can't play Ragavan. What is this? Oh, man. This might be a fishy keep, but we'll see. We'll see. Storm Drake. Oh my god. We lost, boys. <laughs> oh no. Brainstorm locked. So I did that before their turn because if they're playing Storm Drake, they have to have like bunch of like protection spells. Staff of Domination. Well, well, well. Uh oh.
opponent. What, what are you? What, what are you trying to cook? What's happening here? <laughs> Orcish Bowmaster meta. Infinite Orcish Bowmasters. Infinite. I'm gonna keep that. Oh god. Yeah, I'm not sure, like, how- how good is Brainstorm in this deck, though? Truly. It's like, it's alright. I mean, it, it's good... ...at finding lands. My... ...god. Do we believe in drawing a playable creature? I believe. Opponent mulligans. Ooh. Okay, well. I can't stop the channel because. I don't have a spell pierce, so. We need a black source. So that's, that's land, artifact, instant speed. So we need a creature. That's one of the reasons I'm playing two copies of Spell Pierce in this deck rather than like one copy. So that we can uh, Spell Pierce on turn one. Ugin. Okay. We don't need another land. See if we can find something good. Um, I wanna put a copy of uh, that and this. And then we're gonna brainstorm again. So we can put the Dragon Rage Channeler, so we can flip this, uh, Dragon Rage Channeler. Doesn't matter how we do it. I should have actually targeted them. Now we have a Spell Pierce and... Counter Spell up. I think I'm actually just going to thoughts easier. Another mistress bobble. Why didn't they cast channel? Wait, why didn't they cast channel last turn? So maybe I'm not supposed to. Oh man. Oh man. Am I supposed to mulligan because I don't have Thoughtseize and Spell Pierce? I think I am. I am very scared. Especially because I'm going second, right? So I need to Spell Pierce. Okay, well not anymore. Not after seeing this card.
Val key. Okay, that's a bit annoying. Most definitely annoying. Most definitely annoying. So I actually need to... Oh man, there. I, I, need, I actually need another blue source. We need a way to get rid of Valky. I need to brainstorm next turn in my uh, my own main phase because Valky can transform to Orcish Bowmaster at any given time. Mistress Bobble? That's not bad, actually. Should I just run out the Ragavan here? Hmm... Let's just run it out. I should have actually just held on to this mistrust bubble, huh? I wasn't gonna surveil there anyways. Maybe I attack. To get back uh, Orcish Bowmaster into my hand. Sure. Okay, well, if they did that, I guess I'll just pop it. Just to draw more extra card. They're gonna draw a hive. I'm just going to keep attacking so I can get the card back. What is going on? I should actually tap this for additional damage. Mishra's bubble is so nice. That should flip the DRC. Okay, they're gonna draw a land. Uh, this is foretell... Sure. Because we get- we get to surveil one, one more time. Brainstorm. A top two. Another brainstorm. Play out the Death Shadow. Attack and pass. Yep, 
Yeah, I'm not sure about the brainstorm. Consider is probably a lot better. Yeah, consider is a lot better. Pwns down to four. I'll keep playing around with the brainstorm, but I think eventually we'll have to kind of swap this out. Just because we don't have fetch land, a brainstorm in this deck is pretty mediocre. Okay, GG's. Double Thoughtsies, two Mistress Bubble. Sure, why not? Triple Thoughtsies. Huh. Grab the Fable. Okay, I don't know what they're playing. I'm, I'm gonna keep this uh, one Mistress Bubble for potential future Dragon Rage Chandler. Ooh. That's pretty hot. Ragavan Go. I should have probably played Mistress Bubble and then see what they got before playing the Ragavan out. So, Sorcery, Artifact. Hmm. They're gonna draw if we go for the throat. So I'm gonna bring the Loras in. So we, we need an instant speed in the graveyard. Does playing the unholy heat Count towards Delirium. I feel like it doesn't. Yeah, I feel like it shouldn't. But I'm not 100%, so. Dear Lord. Okay, do I go to one? Do I go to one here? We'll go to one. <laughs> oh my god. I probably should have attacked first, by the way. I mean, killed a...
Why is my opponent not attacking with the the other card? Another Death Shadow? Don't mind if I do. Wait. Once during each turn, you may cast a Dragon Creature f spell from the graveyard. Oh, wow. Why did they leave? So I'm going first. We don't have a black source, but we have Unholy Heat. Elvish Mystic. I'm just gonna crack this. We're also gonna kill this. Bowmaster. Again, we're gonna kill this. Nice. Now we have Drone in the Lock online for future channels. Another Mystic. We're just farming Mystics right now. Nice. I could have expressed iteration for a land for a land, but but there there was a good chance that like we might not get it. Pact of negation. Wow. Can they win this turn though? They have to win this turn if you're packed on negationing. <laughs> no way! <laughs> okay, that's broken. <laughs> How much do I believe? I want to believe. Yeah, pulling them all to five. I think I will thought seize. Yep. That would have been a disaster. Absolute disaster. Is that what people are doing? Just hard mulligan to channel? I do want to land. Okay, um... I actually want to Thought Seize next turn.
The reason being is uh, even if they draw a channel, I can deal with the boring clicks. But I don't think I can deal with the channel into a causal leg. Forgot to attack there, but that's fine. Lotus Field. Bubble. Two bubbles. Green Sun Twilight. I mean, they got four, four mana. That's not going to do anything. Yeah, so the only thing that's like kind of iffy is like the brainstorm here. Just kind of doesn't feel like anything. Isn't there a more broken card than this? Like, I feel like there's a more broken card than that. Let's see what they're about to draw. Or they're gonna draw a forest. Another Thoughtseize. We welcome that. Another Thoughtseize. So we don't care what they draw because they're about to draw a forest anyways. I think this is game. Well, we're at four. I didn't even know. <laughs> I didn't even know. Wait a minute. Yeah, you can draw Nulamog. Yeah, that's insane. Like, Bobble letting us see that extra information, what they're about to draw. So we can kind of plan ahead. Seems kind of broken. We keep those. The question is, is, is it Ragman or Dragon Ray Chandler though? Oh man. I think it has to be Ra uh, Dragon Ray Chandler. Because we kept the one lander. Demonic Tutor. Okay, we got another land, so... Counterspell is technically online. No! My Counterspell! Wow. Okay, that's... Uh, that's a, that's a bit weird. Why they do that? Blue. Demonic tutor. Mm, 
We'll pass. Orcish Bowmaster. This is probably a board wipe they got. Hmm. Another Ragavan? I think we need a land. We need a black land. There you go. That worked out better than I thought. Maybe they grabbed Orcish Bowmaster. Maybe that's the thing that they grabbed. Oh no no. The games are so fast. Yeah, games are so fast. So is this what Historic could have been? Just more fun? Just way more fun and goodness. I mean, minus a channel, like, okay, you take out a channel. I think that's good. You take out the channel and we're good. Wish Claw. Another one. Hmm. I mean, if they're going to Wish Claw here, am I supposed to just go Loras fetch? Uh, I don't know. Maybe I should have, but they could have also like wished for a thought season and get rid of a uh, Loras. Okay, interesting. They use the black source instead of the mountain. This could be a lightning bolt. There you go. Counter spell. Okay, the counter spell has been putting in so much work. It's insane. It's actually insane. They have to upgrade the token. <laughs> Oh boy. Should I grab a Thoughtseize? Probably not. I mean, they're dead. Just counter spell and get it over with. So far, we haven't lost a game, but we could have definitely. Actually, no, no, no. We we lost to that one game. Uh, channel. They had a channel into a uh, deal 14 damage. That was rough.
Yes, please. So good. Man, I really want the, the original DRC and the uh, historic. So good. It's so good. I miss it. So dearly. Zero mana card. Ragvan. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Goodbye. Next turn we got expressive iteration to leave up a mana open for spell pierce. This is lightning bolt by the way. Yeah, I forget I forget that I'm playing with these uh, Japanese art cars, so I could Thought Seize, Lightning Bolt, Spell Pierce as well. I think I kind of like that more. Okay, Channel can go. Bowmaster can go. So what do we need? We just need land? Or artifact? Yes, that's how it works. They're hovering over my Orcish Bowmaster and they have Uro and Growth Spiral in their hand. That is exactly how it works. If you draw a card, this will ping you one. This also grows. Man, this deck is just destroying every competition. Okay, so we played a bunch of games and we only lost to one deck. Um, it was a channel deck that played Devil's Play. Basically, you mulligan, 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 mulligan into uh, two lands, into Devil's Play and Channel and win the game on turn three. Well, you know, which is kind of whatever. But even against a deck like that, um, if we just mulligan into Thoughtseize and Spell Pierce and some counter spells, you're going to have some good time. And uh, Mistress Bobble, Dragon Rage Channeler, has been absolutely stellar. Wish we had a Dragon Rage Channeler in Historic that isn't nerfed, by the way. And uh, yeah, I had tons of fun playing a generating treasure with the Ragvan. Wow, it has been amazing. Put it in Historic, Wizard of the Coast. <laughs> and uh, we also got to play with the unnerfed Unholy Heat. It's still a bit miserable, but maybe it's a necessary evil in a Sheldred format in Historic. Maybe we need this unnerfed as well in Historic. Maybe make it 5 damage instead of 6 so it can cleanly answer Sheldred. Maybe that's what we need in Historic. And Lightning Bolt also has been relatively okay. Um, I didn't really get into a situation where the 3 damage actually mattered, but also pretty good. But what I have noticed, but one thing I've noticed was that uh, Brainstorm, which was in the deck before, is now not in the deck. I have completely replaced it with Consider. Consider is just a really good card in this deck because it synergizes well with Ra uh, Dragon Rage Handler. Brainstorm on the other hand, I'm gonna give a hot take here. This card sucks in this particular deck. Just because we're operating with uh, 18 lands, we can't have a card such as Fable Passage in this deck, which is the only fetch land, one of the worst ones at that as well. So we can't play Fable. We're three color deck. We can't play Fable Passage. So this card sucks. We don't have any shuffle effects in the deck. So yeah, not all the banned cards are good in this deck. So yeah, I mean, this is this has been one of the most funs I've had in Historic. I'm not gonna lie, like it's just really efficient creatures like Dragon Rage Chandler, Ragavan, Orkish Bowmaster, Death Shadow. 
it's just tons of fun. And you got some spell pierces and thought seizes to get rid of channel cards. And then you got some counter spells as well. Counter spell is better than memory lapse in this format, I think. Because let's say you memory lapse channel. They're just going to replay it next turn and win the game. So because the memory lapse puts it on top and not really counter it, it's not, even though it was terrorizing historic before, in this format where you just win on turn two with just channel into some card, it's not the greatest card. Like you, you'd rather counter fully on turn two, right? And uh, because we're also playing counter spell, um, I did replace a blood crypt into a uh, mana confluence. So now we have 16 copies of blue source. It should be 20 blue sources, but I mean, 18 land deck, it's hard to fit 20 blue sources into the deck, isn't it? But yeah, that is going to be it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video so far. And if you did, leave a like, comment below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.